Hi everybody. On this video, I will show you how to run Windows Defender Antivirus Scan in offline mode, and how to troubleshoot Windows Defender offline scan if not starting properly or crashing while scanning. Offline antivirus scan is crucial for cleaning infected computers, because some viruses can't be removed in normal mode, especially if the malicious malware takes the control over the antivirus activities. Therefore, the offline scan can help detecting and removing all threats that may bypass the Windows shell, such as viruses and rootkits that infect or modify the master boot record or MBR. Let's starting with the offline scanning before showing how to troubleshoot the app errors. Open Windows Security Antivirus app from Notification Area, open Virus and Threat Protection and then click on Scan Options. Select Microsoft Defender Antivirus Offline Scan option and then click on Scan Now icon. From pop-up messages select Scan and then click on Yes options. The computer will reboot into offline mode and then start scanning and cleaning the computer from malware and threat infections. If the app didn't detect a malware, the computer will restart into normal mode without showing any additional messages. But if it has detected a malware, it will show a message saying that, preliminary scan results show there might be malicious or potentially unwanted software on your system. At the end of scanning, the app will clean the detected threats automatically. How to show Microsoft Defender offline scan results. You can show Microsoft Defender antivirus scan result by opening the app from notification area. After that, open virus and threat protection and then click on protection history. If there are no detected viruses, you will not see anything in the protection history. How to fix Microsoft Defender Antivirus Offline Scan if not working If the Microsoft Defender Antivirus Offline Scan failed to start, you have to check the recovery status as following. Search for command prompt and run it as administrator. Execute this command to check whether the recovery environment is enabled or disabled. Reagency slash info. If disabled, you have to enable it using this command. Reagency slash enable. Execute reagency slash info command again to confirm that it has enabled. Refer to video description for more details about enabling recovery environment. Back to Microsoft Defender Antivirus and run the offline scan again. As you can see, the offline scan started successfully. How to fix Windows Defender offline crashing during scan. If Windows Defender offline scan stops at 80% or earlier, try to download the latest security update package manually from the link in video description. Double click the package installer to update the Windows Defender. You will not see the installation progress, as this is a silent installation. If the offline scan stopped at 91 or 92% or thereafter, it may not be considered as crashing. To check if the app crashes, right click on start icon and then select event viewer. Navigate to the shown path. If there is any event with the time of your offline scan flagged with error label, then the offline scan was crashed. So read the error details to see if there is a reason for its crashing. Also you can open the MSSS wrapper file from this path. Scroll down to the bottom of the log file. If the offline scan completed with 0x0 value, then the scan ended without error. But if the value is 0x1 or 0x8 is what happened with me before updating the app, then the app crashes while scanning. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, leave a comment and subscribe.